Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is gonna be super fun because I'm going to be like unboxing my juicer that I got. Um, first, I'm gonna go to the grocery store and get um, some items so I can like test the juicer out. So the items I'm gonna get, I'm gonna try to recreate this drink that I got in Thornton Park from this juice bar. It's called Raw Juice Bar, but it has kale, apple, and pineapple to cleanse and purify your body. So I'm gonna try to recreate that, at least like see if it'll taste similar. Also too, I wanna film a like six month update from working out at Cycle Bar. So I'm gonna also do that because I just really wanna like show progress photos and stuff that I took today. I'm super excited to film that. But this video is gonna be mainly about like my juicer and like testing it out. I've never like used anything like that. Okay, so minor change. I stopped at Target because I need to go to the bathroom real quick. But I'm gonna get my oil changed and then go home because I'm really, really hungry. But I still need to get my oil changed. So that's what I'm gonna do. And then we'll settle the juice, the juicer or whatever. Also, I really wanna film that video so I don't know, maybe I'll do the juicer thing tomorrow, but at least I'll just shop for it. But I still want it to be part of this video. So I don't know, we're just a hot mess right now. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Just gonna go with the flow, but right now I'm gonna head to Valvoline. I think I'm just gonna get the synthetic. It's gonna be like expensive, but I'm driving to Destin and I just want like, you know, good oil in the car. I think that's what I'm gonna do. I don't know, it depends on how much it is. It's, if it's like $100, like no thank you. I'll just do synthetic blend instead of like the actual, like only synthetic, you know? Because I don't wanna be paying that much. And I have to get gas too, but I'm not gonna get that today. I'll just get it like sometime on Monday. All right, so got Chick-fil-A. Wasn't gonna get Chick-fil-A. I actually wasn't gonna eat out at all because I just shouldn't be doing that. But I was out, I'm starving, so that's what it boils down to. Um, oh my gosh, this lady that like works with Chick-fil-A, she was like, um, she was like motioning me to roll down my window and I'm like, bro, like it doesn't roll down. So like I needed to um, open the door, but I didn't want to open it and not be able to hear her. Hold on, in this wacko intersection here. I swear they need to put more lights because it's just insane. She was like, kind of had attitude and she's like, have a blessed day. And I'm like, oh wow, like don't pull that one on me girl. But you know, if they didn't have such good food, like I definitely wouldn't eat there. Cause like, you know, I say this in every one of my videos, their values are a little different and I don't know, but whatever. It's not every day that I go to Chick-fil-A, so it's fine. But dude, she was just so sassy. I'm like, okay, bro, like it doesn't roll down. Um, she's like, this is how your food is like processed. I'm like, okay, like whatever. But it's fine, got the food. Now I'm gonna go home and relax a little bit. I don't know how much I'm gonna do with the juicer today. Cause when I get home, I'm feeling like I just wanna stay home. I don't think I wanna go out again. I don't know. We will see. And the grocery store is not far from my house. It's like two minutes away. So I might go. I might not go. All I know now is like I want to eat. So <laughs> I'm going to eat because it is like two o'clock and I never eat really this late. Like I'm very organized when it comes to like timing and mules because I like it to be spaced out like nicely. I'm kind of glad it hasn't started raining. It's, I think it's supposed to start raining at three. So that's another reason why I probably won't go out to get, if it's raining, I probably won't go out. If it's not raining, then I might go out to get the stuff. But I do want to unbox the thing. So I know that is definitely on the to-do list today for filming purposes. Um, I also have to edit the video that I just like finished today and get that up because it's Saturday and I typically upload on Saturdays. Like I like to get three videos up, like that's my goal. So. I'm gonna edit a video after I eat, probably. But I'm just gonna take it easy. I like my weekends to be chill. Okay, so I just got a 12 count with like, oh my gosh, that's like barely any fries. I swear, inflation is like horrible. <laughs> oh my gosh, well, hey, you know what? I don't need the extra calories, I guess. Yo, like, can we just like take a minute? Like, where's the fries? <laughs> that's hilarious, anyway. Whatever, it's fine. Well, I got more nuggets, I feel like, because I got the 12 count, because I know sometimes they're like 
stingy, so glad I got more nuggets though. After lunch, I edited and posted my uh, cycle bar like update, my six month update. So if you haven't watched that, check it out. Oh, then I went to the store, got my stuff for my green juice that I'm gonna make tomorrow. And then I am going to, oh my gosh, did this just like fall? Then I went to the store, then I came back home, took off my makeup, showered, and I think now we're here. Right now it is almost seven, so I'm gonna eat soon, but I just wanna import some footage into my computer so I can get to editing. I'm kinda tired, I don't know if I'll actually edit tonight, probably not, but when I get up tomorrow, I'll bust out the video because it's probably not that long, but I just wanna get the footage in here so I have it and like, it's ready. It's another day, day in paradise here. I am going to unbox my little juicer that I got for myself. And this is not sponsored or anything. This is seriously like I bought this with my own money from Amazon. I'll link it down below if you want to check it out. But um, I wanted to try it out because I've been drinking a lot of like green juice and stuff. Not recently, which is really bad, but I actually really like it. So I have some ingredients that I wanna try out and everything. So I'm gonna unbox this. And I've been putting this off for so long because I just haven't had the right time to like film this. So it looks like this is the instruction booklet. Hey Sherry, I'm unboxing my, oh. my juicer. Okay. Ooh, she's pretty. I got one too that also made sure that it matched the house. So this is what it looks like. Nice stainless steel. And I'm hoping it doesn't look like there's much to it. I'm gonna have to read the instructions. At least I got it out of the bag. I mean, out of the box. I wonder if this, I don't know where that goes. Here's the manual. One eternity later. Okay, hi guys. Oh my goodness. I have been like slacking on this freaking juicer for forever. You know, it's been several days later and we're finally now just using this. And I will be completely honest with you. It's number one because I've been lazy and number two, it's just like, I just have been putting it off. And I, you know, I should have just done it the day that I got the freaking thing. Like I should have just went to the store and like got stuff. Oh my gosh, sorry. My hair is looking crazy because I went to the pool and I didn't wash it today because I want to wash it tomorrow. Anyway, so I think I have everything here. So have my apple like all cut up. I got pre-sliced um, pineapple and then this is kale. And we're gonna just see how this works and hopefully it'll work well. Okay, I'm gonna like do this so you guys can see. Um, sorry, can't really see. You know what, maybe I will put you guys like right here because this is where the juice like will fall into. Sorry, this is like kind of a hot mess. But back to what I was saying, oh my gosh, guys, like I've been putting this off and it's just one of those things that it's like, I just don't want to do it. <laughs> but I have all this stuff and like, I'm surprised it's like stayed good this long. So I might as well do it and I need to film it for the vlog, obviously. Um, this is, again, like I said in the video, I bought this and whatever, but like, this literally feels like what a sponsorship would be like. And like, I'm just not feeling like doing this, you know? <laughs> but again, I don't want all this stuff to go to waste. I don't know, like, do I turn it on? I'm kind of glad that they gave you this because it's like apples, six medium apples equals two cups of juice. And like, they give you all this stuff, but I don't know if I need to turn the knob to one or two. I think I'm gonna start off with the low speed. Um, so I think all you do, put it in there and then you put this thing there and then, oh my goodness. Oh, there we go. There we go. Holy crap. Well, that was the first apple. Um, next up we have another apple that I'm going to like put in there. Oh, you kind of have to push down. Okay, then. Um, that's 
that's interesting. Okay, so here is the final product. I honestly think it's turned out pretty good. A lot better than I thought it would. I'm gonna try it on camera, but I just wanna show you guys. Also, I have a little bit left here, so I might as well just finish it up. Valerie said she will not be trying it. And then this is gonna be like a pain in the ass to like clean because look at all this, like the pulp and everything. So I'm gonna have to learn from the instruction manual like how to clean it which I'm not looking forward to but it's okay I you know wanted to try something new and see how it is and probably do it again in the future like when I'm feeling like it more and now I'm like more familiarized with it like it'll probably come a second nature pretty soon okay so when I was making it obviously I wasn't stirring it up so I was like kind of nervous I'm like this is not a lot of product but it actually turns out pretty good so gonna try it now hopefully it's good fingers crossed mmm it does take taste like the green juice that I bought that one day I think I did a really good job to be honest really 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 good I'm kind of surprised at how good this tastes considering like it was my first time ever juicing anything in my entire life so A plus, A plus, like I'm like kind of pleasantly surprised. I will not enjoy the process of cleaning the thing up, which I will show you guys because I think that'll be kind of funny, like me trying to take that thing apart and then cleaning it. I'm loving this, I'm loving this. My hair looks like crazy. Basically, it was a lot easier to disassemble after I like just read the instructions. So I just literally went step by step following this guide and it's super, super easy. There's no, it's like you just take out one thing. So first it's like this thing and then um, this plastic thing and then this metal, um, the shredder and then this uh, black piece right here as well as this little bucket and that's pretty much it so overall like it's only a few pieces what like six pieces that you have to do and it's really simple so i think that is going to be it for this juicer video hope you guys enjoyed it make sure to give it a thumbs up i'm feeling a little bit more encouraged about the juicer now after doing all of that if you want to get the juicer then just uh click the link down below and i will see you guys in my next video bye